Luke the Apostate. Welcome to my channel. I have a longer 10-minute introduction video that sort of unpacks everything. You can get that right here. But for this very, very short introduction, I just want to say hi. I'm an atheist. I used to be a fundamentalist Christian. Got a master's degree in theological studies. <clears throat> became an atheist. Realized that my master's degree was not going to be as useful in the context uh, that I hoped to use it in. Saw a lot of YouTube videos about atheism while I was sort of reprocessing everything. Uh, really valued the atheist YouTube community. Wanted to contribute back to it. Couldn't think of a way. Watched some more YouTube atheist videos. Noticed that there's a lot of atheists who didn't grow up in a fundamentalist Christian household. There are a couple. Um, I'm not going to shout them all out, but there's a lot of fundamentalist Christians who become atheists, uh, but don't have you know, highfalutin seminary degrees. Uh, I do. Now, there's a lot of people I can't, you know, replace, or, and I don't want to replace them, and I can't, uh, I can't really supplement their work, but there's a space I think I can fill, and that is translating from fundamentalist Christian to atheist. Uh, there, there's a lot of different terms that Christians use in a Christian way, that atheists not using in a Christian way get very confused by. Um, there's some terms Christians use that Christians aren't aware is jargon. Phrases like the literal meaning of the Bible. Um, there's a great deal of debate between atheists and Christians about what literal literally means there, for example. Now, I'm not hoping to you know form a bridge between our people, but I would like to be able to explain the the cultural context and the theological, interpretive, historical context of a lot of the things that fundamentalist Christians say that confuse atheists, whether the the, the Christian is is saying is using some term of jargon or whether the Christian is making some reference to the Old Testament that makes very little sense unless you've spent ten years singing a certain song in church. So I've got a lot of videos I hope to make. Uh, I, I hope to be regular, if not necessarily frequent, uh, and thank you for coming to my channel. I hope you will find it interesting. Uh, if, if I do it right, uh, my, my goal is that you will find it both entertaining and enlightening. Uh, thank you for coming to my channel, and uh, have a look at the next video.